This video will cover 12 amazing facts of the African fat-tailed gecko, so let's begin. Number 1. They have a fat tail. The tail of the African fat-tailed gecko is what makes it stand out the most. This has vertical parts that span its full length and is particularly wide and thick in shape. The tail serves as a vital energy reserve and is used to store fat. If food is scarce, they are capable of going days without eating. African fat-tailed geckos have the ability to deliberately lose their tails if they are attacked or feel threatened. This will make their predator confused and let them go away. If this happens, a new tail will develop. It will eventually take on a shape even more rounded than their prior tail, resembling their head. The new tail may be a different color or pattern from the gecko's body as a whole. Number 2. Their thick tail equals healthy gecko. An African fat-tailed gecko's health can be determined only by glancing at its tail. They will show signs of inadequate food by developing a skinny tail. It could also be a symptom of a disease. A healthy African fat-tailed gecko will have a plump, well-rounded tail. The more space their tail has, the greater access they have to food because this is where they keep their fat. Number 3. Their natural habitat. This lizard is found in West Africa, specifically between Senegal and Cameroon. It can be found on a variety of landforms, such as savannas, riverbanks, and dry deserts. The fat-tailed gecko's physical characteristics are influenced by the region of Africa where it lives. They will differ in size, color, and scale pattern to be able to live in the environment they are provided. Number 4. They have distinct patterns. These thick-tailed lizards exhibit designs with brown and tan banding and an underside that is pinkish or off-white by nature. A lengthy white stripe that covers the full length of certain geckos' bodies is another distinguishing feature. In captivity, additional pattern differences arise via selective breeding. This can apply to geckos that are albino, abnormal, patternless, completely black, or even tangerine in color. Number 5. Albino morphs are rare. Due to their unusual appearance, albino fat-tailed geckos remain scarce and in high demand. They follow a pattern that is similar to other types. They differ, though, in that their bases are white or pink and their bands are a lighter shade of orange. Ghost, Oreo, Starburst, and Whiteout are other uncommon fat-tailed gecko variants. Even though it's hard to find various color variations, the albino is still the most uncommon of the bunch. Keep in mind that when shedding, an African fat-tailed lizard may also seem white or pink in color. Every three to four weeks, this procedure happens. Number six, they are not social. The fat-tailed geckos of Africa are not sociable. They prefer to be alone, save from when they are mating. The adults do not stay with their offspring even after egg laying or giving birth. Female fat-tailed geckos can share an enclosure when kept in captivity. Men shouldn't be kept together, though. They are aggressive and will engage in conflict to protect their territory. Number 7. They are insectivores. African fat-tailed geckos solely consume insects because they are insectivorous animals. A variety of insects, including crickets, roaches, mealworms, king mealworms, and silkworms, are part of the African fat-tailed gecko's diet. They mostly only eat insects that are smaller than the breadth of their very own heads. Number 8. They can blink. Most geckos do not have eyelids. Consequently, they will lick their eyes to keep them fresh and moist. African fat-tailed geckos can blink since they have eyelids. This allows them to maintain clean eyes in their dusty environment. They are one of the very few gecko species capable of doing this. Number 9. They are not good at climbing. The majority of geckos have adhesive lamellae, which are sticky patches on the soles of their feet. They can readily climb on structures and even dangle upside down. These fat-tailed lizards do not have sticky toe pads. They find it challenging to ascend vertically as a result. Number 10. Comparing the fat-tailed gecko versus leopard gecko. Both leopard geckos and African fat-tailed geckos belong to the Eubulferidae subfamily. They are comparable in certain ways. For instance, the physical shapes of both species are comparable. Additionally, both of these varieties of geckos have real eyelids that enable them to blink. They each have a distinctive disposition though. Leopard geckos are much more energetic and less docile than African fat-tailed geckos which are typically laid back and quiet. Number 11. They thrive in captivity. In captivity, fat-tailed geckos thrive and are a popular choice for reptile pets. They stay a tiny size and are peaceful, placid creatures. When not under danger, they move slowly. This is mainly because they find it hard to move too fast due to their big tails. These characteristics make them simple to handle and take care of. After settling down for the first week or two, they often don't mind when others handle them. Over time, you'll even notice that they begin to take on distinct personalities of their own. They can live in captivity for up to 25 years with the right care. Number 12. They are nocturnal. The fat-tailed geckos of Africa are nocturnal. They preserve their energy by sleeping under rocks and bark or in cracks during the day. They will set out in search of food after sunset. They will consume a wide variety of insects, but their preferred insects are mealworms and crickets. Snakes, larger reptiles, as well as different birds and animals, are the predators of the African fat-tailed gecko. Thanks for watching.